Okay. Ron's net. Ron's net is surviving while um, Ron's away. Shane's doing a good job. I'm mobile. Have a look at that signal. Shane can't hear me. That's unreal. I don't know. Um, Steve had me about five and nine, but I don't know. I reckon the hospital must be causing a bit of noise, but wouldn't. So there's a few there. All right. Okay. So the main point of this video uh, is not to just show you Ron's net, show you the countryside. And guess where we are today? Is this a new sign, guys? I don't know. I, 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 it just looks a lot more bright and cheerful. Um, why are the Adelaide Crows on this sign? Well, they're not having the best year, I suppose. Maybe the full power should be on there. Um, geez, a lot of people put their stickers on here. Girls can ride, gutters SA. Oh, geez. Anyway, um, so I'm on my way to Adelaide. Uh, obviously, there's the other sign down there that says, you know, don't bring rubbish uh, into the state. Uh, I had to do a quick repair on the trailer. We had a light out over there, and it's the wiring comes through the side, and... Um, uh, the only way I could do is quickly just patch this side here over this side, just run a quick clamp there. I did this at, in the, the dark at 7 o'clock last night. But uh, anyway, that's uh, all good. But yeah, we'll get the HR on today in Adelaide. So um, this is the donor car that's uh, the previous videos. There's two videos up with the um, car from uh, Moama, uh, from my mate over there. And that's one with the V8 uh, block in it uh, with the, um, the blueprinted balanced motor, etc. Turbo 350 and 9-inch rear. So it's a really good start point. So the one we're picking up today is uh, going to be really just for bits and pieces, believe it or not. We've bought an entire car for bits and pieces. I've had to take the Pajero. I thought about taking the Trackhawk, but no. I'm, I'm sort of set up with radios and I'd, I've got to bring some stuff in the back. Uh, we've got a few windscreens that are spare uh, back at the in Adelaide that we're picking up, so we'll be sort of loading them. Uh, as you can see, these are uh, uh, they're cushioned tarps, these, so we, we use them as we put the windscreens in, etc. etc. Anyway, it's a beautiful day. Look at that blue sky, lovely, absolutely lovely. And um, there you go, that road goes back to Victoria. I'll be traveling it later tonight. I was going to go to Adelaide. Unfortunately, everyone was busy. One of my real good friends has got a, a quiz night on tonight and um, and family over. And look, you know what? I don't want to disturb that in any way because it's, uh, I, she doesn't get to see some of this family very often. Um, and, um, and everybody else was busy anyway. So I got up early this morning and I thought, right, can I, can I make sort of something out of this? And I thought, yes, I can. I can leave at seven from, I, I stopped in Swan Hill last night. So I drove through from uh, uh, probably probably about 8 o'clock I got out of uh, Tangambalanga and I got in about 1 o'clock at uh, Swan Hill. Uh, they, they keep a motel room for the, uh, that's great, you know, I just, the key's in the door, I go in, it's, it's brilliant. Um, uh, paddle steamer uh, motel in Swan Hill, just want to give them a bit of a plug uh, because um, they go out of their way to help us every time I do this trip. And what, what the plan will be is to get back to the paddle steamer tonight. So that's going to be, I need to get into uh, Adelaide by about 2 o'clock. Uh, it's now about uh, 10.30 in the morning. So I've got to make some good time. Uh, I need to be in Adelaide uh, by 2 o'clock, three hours to get everything on here. And there's a lot of bits and pieces that we're going to have to string up. Um, the thing that I'm fearful of is just whether we can get everything on. Um, <laughs> we'll see. It's going to be a very packed back. Uh, there's a lot of parts and there's a lot of, well, and don't get me wrong, um, even though it's got the HR Prem interior in it, which we're going to get reupholstered, um, um, we can still get some stuff inside the car too. So anyway, we'll work it out and make it all happen. All right, well, based on that, I better um, start getting out of here uh, if I'm going to make this happen and, uh, you know, actually get, uh, get this plan happening. Let's have a listen. Hang on, Shane, there was a BK1 station trying to call in there to you, mate, uh, but he's uh, fairly low down as well. I'll tell you what, S Steve is hearing so much more 
I reckon it's the hospital. I really do. I think Shane gets a lot of noise from the hospital. He's, he's about two blocks away from the hospital. So I do feel for him because I live next to a ho- I live next to Modbury Hospital at one stage. Biggest mistake I ever made. Well, not next to it, but close enough, you know, that it was a pain. Anyway, he's, he's doing a good job, though. He's, uh, you know, anyone that can... Sorry, turn that down a bit. Anyone that can be up daily and uh, can be doing net like this you know it, it's not easy it really isn't it's uh total concentration and uh and you you've got to be there um 24 7 and yeah i couldn't do it <laughs> i'm just going to admit it i could not do it all right guys i'll um look at my mess in here seriously all those straps and stuff ready to go there's um there's a bunch of cash in there for i've got to pay this lady uh jeez shouldn't say that anyway <laughs> all right I'm going to click off and um, probably going to have a quick wee over there, a little tree over there. I've, I've just, uh, maybe it was coming out into, the wind's a bit cool, it's only uh, out here, oh, it's about 13 degrees, so it's come up, it was 5 degrees when I, no, it was 2 degrees when I left, so anyway. Alright, 73s, we're on the border, my old home state, go the crows, bloody useless, go Port Power, you know what? <laughs> now I'm in Victoria. I suppose I can really dodge between whoever's winning out of the Crows and Port Power. These Port, Port's doing very well. Um, look, you know what? I'll always be a Crows fan. I've got to say that. But I'm very impressed with uh, Port Power this year. All right, it's time we get a final, South Australia. Let's let's win an AFL final again. Cheers, guys.